So a lot of times, if you're suffering with symptoms similar to that of tennis elbow, the muscles in the myofascial system is really irritated and so to speak inflamed. So we need to kind of loosen that up. So what I want you to do is put your arm, whatever arm that's bothering you, go ahead and put it on a table. And you're gonna use a lacrosse ball, at least that's what I'm gonna suggest. And you're gonna go ahead and use the opposite hand to kind of roll around and engage and find that tender spot. A lot of times with those who have tennis elbow that I've worked with, their most painful spot is closest to the elbow. It's not necessarily down by the wrist. A progression is actually when you extend your arm. A lot of times those who have tennis elbow, their symptoms are much worse when their elbows are extended versus bent. So as you go ahead and straighten it out, you might actually find that there are some more so to speak, hidden spots that come out and become a little bit more noticeable when you start to use the, your lacrosse ball. So the act of progression, all right, because the previous two were pretty much passive, you're gonna notice at my wrist, I'm actually bringing my wrist down towards the ground as I stroke the, the lacrosse ball across the top of my muscles from the closest to me all the way away. And then I kind of stroke it like that as I go down with my hand initially reaching up and then going down as I push the lacrosse ball down on top of my muscles. Again, if it's painful, it probably means you're doing the right stuff, but don't be barbaric, listen to your body and do what you think is therapeutic.